morning, so that's half five. We're up, we're away. Check out where we are. Cool sky and all that here. But look at this. Oh, you see that? How awesome is that? Totally epic. Oh, see, here's the castle here. There's hundreds of folk camping over there. Ruining it. So I came to the castle car park and just slept in the back of the dusty bin. Who are you saying, Moscow? Wanna say hi? Oh, yeah, wee traitor. Yeah, wee beastie, yeah. Look, doing a runner. Unbelievable. So half five in the morning. Look at how cool this is. Look at the sky. It's going to be an amazing bogies. Bogey alert. It's going to be an amazing day, isn't it? Where are they? Can't you see them? Look, it looks amazing in here as well. There, there, there. There, there, there. Love that. Look how awesome this castle is, though, by the way. I heard some folk last night at the car park coming back into their car and heading back down here. And it must be these guys here. These fishing traps. They're not exactly fishing, though. It's more like putting a rod out and then going sleeping in your tent. I could do that. Fling a line out. Go and get half jacked in the tent. Again? Fishing. No fishing or that. Sleeping. What did you do at the weekend? I was away fishing. Pished. Who's that? <coughs> What'd you hear? <coughs> cool, eh? Here's a death plunger. It's a sleeping bag. In the frickin' water. Free sleeping bag down there if you want it. Condition. Wet. What you got? I'm gonna bring it here then. <sighs> were empty so there's two folk have pitched their tents and I put it lying out and oh yeah right cool what are you saying to a cool we one what do you think Moss? Hey what do you like it? Do you like the castle? Yeah? So you can pause this if you want to read it. The castle was only besieged once. The barrel vaulted basement you pass through with its prison cell off to one side is part of Sir Colin's original tower house. The fallen turret before you was added to its top more than a century later by his great grandson, Grey Colin. The castle was only besieged once by a royalist army in 1654. Look at this, Black Duncan and Slippery John. That's not really, I'd rather be called Black Duncan to be fair. Charmstone, cool. So this square, this, uh, this here, it was originally a tower house, so it would have been a, a tower. Sort of squarish base, you know, tying it up moss. With the main door higher up, you walked up wooden steps, you could take it off, you know, so like, remove the steps so folk couldn't just like ram it, they would just be ramming walls. And then they'd, to get into the building, you'd have to actually make, put your own ladders up, and when you were trying to do that, they would just leather you for above. But yeah, that, 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 I wonder if that's the dungeon. Where's my torch? Oh, that's stairs. That'll be stairs leading up to the tower. Oh, look, you can go in here. I oh, know you can. Oh, hey, ladders all leading up, tempting you to, to nothing. Folks wondered places like that. See, like, so that's four. How it's all, like, rocky and lumpy. Surely it wasn't like that at the time. Was it covered? What did they have down there? I mean, there's this thing here that looks like some sort of hearth. Aye, so I don't know what the script is with that. What they actually had, because, you know, you see castles like this now with all the stone exposed. But apparently it wasn't like that back in the day. Aye, apparently it was like all, you know, like lime plaster and such. Where are you going up here, Moss? This is really cool. Looks like you can kind of go up. Cool. Big old fireplace there. I wonder if that was the kitchen. Because, you know, sometimes they would have a couple of fires going on with big pots over it. And, like, these are additional fireplaces tying into the... The chimney, the same chimney. So that's one, two, three, four, at least four floors. Aye. Four floors in a in a dungeon. Like doubt yeah, because that was probably because there's no windows in this bottom uh this bottom layer, so that wouldn't have been for folk uh, you know who owned it with any money. So yeah, that's probably like the, the kitchen and where all the cooks were, and then you've got three floors for the, the fancier, probably bedrooms up the stair and, and all that. Don't know what I'm talking about. 
Yeah, these crumbling walls once held remarkable works of art and have inspired poets and painters. So you can see all the decorations that was a had. The richly decorated rooms reflect the high states of the noble hosts. Above you was the Lord's Chamber, its four-posted bed hung with the celebrated Glen Orchid valances. Below these, really cool. I wonder what that's, has that been some big old, I wonder if that's been a well at one point. Often in the middle of these courtyards there was a well with decorations that would have been wee steps and then there was a big decorative top with water coming out of it. But they've just filled it in, I wonder. Cool the old mozzie okay? It's this. The dunny. <laughs> Look, you can see where the stairs used to come up. And there. And this must have been a door coming in from that stairwell. You see the likes of this? Because castles weren't built in Awani often, they were built bit by bit. You see stuff like that often, like where there's been, oh, what's been happening here? Something dodgy. Doesn't quite make sense when you look at it, but it does if you look at it in time. Pistol or rifle holes all around here. That's where you would crouch down and fire your weapon out of. Take that. Cool. Yeah. Well, look. Block to your left contained 12 heated rooms that could hold 200 soldiers. Block to your left. Aye, that's this. That's this here. Oh. That bath barrels, look. Oh yeah. Yeah, dafty. Loads of folk over there camping and fishing. They're just parked up there. Look how nice it is down there. This cool old hotel. Well, nice. Blast a dafty. Oh, you a dafty. Blast a dafty. Oh, cool. It's been cool when that was full, full. Hey, look at this. Crazy. Slowly. Mm. Yeah, wee monkey. Let's go out on this thing. See if it bounces. Listen to these chaps. Just want to get a bounce in that. That's a nice picture though, eh? Gotta get a picture. Right, so what's that? Quarter to ten, bloody hell, been here ages. It's really cool though, eh? Really cool. Such a nice day. Really, really nice day. Aye, so that's us. Well, we're back to the car now. And uh, we'll get on, get on Walk Highlands or something like that and look to see if we can see somewhere good to hike. So I've spent, what time was I there at? I was there at about six, was I not? Six, four and a half hours. It's a cracking place though, isn't it? Totally awesome. Yeah, totally awesome. I'd recommend coming out here. So yeah, we'll see if we can get a wee hike in for the afternoon and then we'll head down the road and uh, maybe get a wee scoop of the old Gena I can. There's a wee shop that's, I don't know if it's opened, I don't think it is, but they're building it. Such a nice day. We got a wee ice cream, vanilla, none of this, none of this fancy gear. The older I get, it's, I'm going back to more meat and, you know, meat and potatoes. 